In this tutorial, we're going to edit this wildlife photo from Mark Smith. First, I'll hide the browser using the shortcut key Command B, so we have a bit more room. Then I'll go up to my Quick Tool tab, which is a great place to start editing. So first, I'd like to add a bit more contrast, and increase the saturation to make the colours a bit more vibrant. To get a bit more definition, I'll decrease the blacks to darken the very darkest tones, and I'll lift the whites as well. Now let's enhance the details even further. I'll zoom to 100% so I'll be able to see my adjustments more clearly. Holding down the spacebar, I can switch to my pan cursor tool and just reposition the photo to get a better view. First, I'll increase the clarity to enhance the midtones. So this will focus on those larger scale transitions. Now I can experiment with the structure slider, so increasing this will enhance the smaller details. So I'll start to see more definition in the feathers and scales, for example. Let's see a quick before and after. So I'll go to my reset adjustments button here in the tool and holding down the alt key, I can press to see before and now after. Let's add some sharpening as well. So I can increase the amount slider to really enhance those details even further. I'll also increase the radius, which controls the width of the sharpened edges. So see what works for your photo. So I'm happy with this. Now I'll zoom back out. Finally, I'd like to adjust the sky color. So I'll head over to the color tool tab and in the color editor tool, I'll select the color picker. Now I'll choose a tone in the sky and this color range will be selected in the color editor tool. So let's experiment with the hue slider. We can move it more towards the magenta tones by going to the right, or we can move it more towards greener tones to the left. So I'll leave this here and I'll just decrease the saturation so it's a bit more subdued. With the lightness slider, I'll brighten the blue tones to make the bird stand out even more. So I'm happy with those adjustments. Here is the photo straight out of camera. And now with just a few quick edits.